I just got a selfie with the Fonz. I mean, of course, this is the man who makes us want to say, hey, right? I didn't do that very well. Henry Winkler. Not bad. Thank you. award-winning actor. I got to witness that earlier this year or last year. Very He's exciting. also an author. This is his latest book. It's called Here's Hank. Everybody is somebody and you are somebody we love. So thank you for being here. And that is the reason that we wrote it because I would lie in bed not far from here on 78th and Broadway and I would be a failure in almost everything except lunch. And I would dream about being somebody. Will I ever be somebody? Because huh. everybody was telling me I was not going to achieve. Well, you certainly have in so many ways. 45 years, almost to the day, yeah. that happy days began to make us happy. <laughs> Did you have any idea of how iconic the, the character of the Fonz No, I only become? had six lines. In the first and show? a lot of them were, hey. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> What was the deal when they cast when they cast you and said this is your character? How did they describe this guy? The uh, you know what, uh, Gary didn't. They put me in a McGregor golf jacket, which was really difficult to be cool in. Yeah. And uh, then I finally got into leather, and then gave the leather to the Smithsonian. I was just going to ask where that was. Yeah. So you do not have one of the original jackets? I do. They, uh, the first one was stolen from the Department of uh, Costumes, and they made five. Uh, they put them under lock and key. They took the, uh, the lining out of one of them when I jumped the shark yes. on water skis. I remember the episode. Uh, and one of them I have, and uh, the late, great Gary Marshall had Aww. another. Incredible experience. Yeah. Thank you for that. And for Barry, On to Barry, Barry is such a great show on Woo! HBO. Yeah. So you win, the, you win the Emmy. I had the pleasure of sitting with you yes. right after you won it. You said that you were not going to lose that Emmy for the life no, of you. No, I'm making a chain right now so I can wear it as a necklace. <laughs> You know, a lot of people say that they use it as a doorstop or it's in the bathroom. You wear yours. Mine is on the dining room table. Good. <laughs> Season two coming there. I want to get, you wanted to read your favorite little passage yes. here. Yes. Uh, you know, uh, I'm going to read the very end of the book. Okay. And then when you get this, this is the last Hank Zipser ever. I know. This is the 29th 20 novel. 29? Yeah. So here we go. And Lynn Oliver um, have written these together, and he wanted his picture on the bulletin board of PS87, which is the school I went to. I'm being told you have 20 seconds. Okay, we here we go. Hear your book. She pushed the door open. My mom did, and she came in. She sat down on the edge of the bed, tucking the covers under my chin like she used to do when I was little, but I'm not little anymore. And she said... You should feel really great. I do, I do, Mom, I feel great. I got my picture on the bulletin board. You see, honey, everything you do, you do your way. It's a gift. I know, but that gift gets me in a lot of trouble. She left the room. She kissed me on the forehead. I heard the door click. My eyes felt heavy. The rest of me felt great. And the last thought that I had before I drifted off to sleep was Hank Zipser. Someday, you're gonna be somebody. GMA fans, Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.